Hi everyone, welcome to another video. This video is going to discuss everything that you can do over the half term break to ensure that you relax and recharge. Let's get started. So the half term holidays are a chance for you to relax and reset from the first half term of the school year. Although the weather is now turning and it is starting to get darker earlier, there are still so many activities that you can do throughout the week to make the most of your time off. Remember though, these are only examples and ideas. Make sure you spend your time doing what you want and need. There is no pressure to fill your week up. It can be just as beneficial to stay at home and take plenty of naps. Why not try pottery painting? If you're looking for a cosy activity this half term, then why not book a pottery painting class? You can decorate something for your house or even decorate a plate for Santa's cookies and milk. It is a great way to unwind, de-stress and meet up with friends or family whilst you paint. You could even get cosy at home. Although they might not be the most memorable days of your half term, spending some time getting cosy at home could be the perfect way to unwind and relax. Get your pyjamas on, a hot drink, a blanket and switch on your favourite film, that new TV series you've been wanting to watch or play that game that's been on your mind this half term. Another great idea is to take a cinema trip. The cinema can be a fantastic way to de-stress as you are guaranteed to concentrate on a film for a set amount of time without any tech distractions. Making the effort to go to the cinema can be a brilliant way to spend an afternoon with friends, a date night or a solo trip to watch that film that you've been eyeing up for a little while in the way that it was made to be watched. Visit your local garden centre. Having a trip out to your local garden centre can be a fantastic way to spend a day off in the October half term. Many garden centres will have their seasonal displays out so you can spend some time feeling festive and browsing their decorations. Or why not get yourself a nice cup of tea? Many of the garden centres will have a cafe on site so it can be the perfect excuse to have a quick catch up with your friends or family over a nice hot drink. Why don't you go pumpkin picking? Although half term lands towards the end of pumpkin picking season, it can be a brilliant way to spend an afternoon picking some pumpkins ready for Halloween. Many farms now offer other activities alongside pumpkin picking, such as tractor rides, play areas, pumpkin carving, and many photo opportunities. So it can be a fantastic family or friend day out. You could even visit a library. Your local library is usually the hidden gem of your hometown. Many libraries run free accessible clubs and activities during the holidays for both adults and children alike. If group activities are not your idea of fun, then it can be a brilliant budget-friendly way to access books and spend a quiet afternoon relaxing. Why don't you try cooking something new? The half term is a fantastic excuse to get those recipe books out and try out some new comfort recipes. Spending time to cook something new for yourself can be a fantastic way to de-stress and spend time looking after yourself and your needs. Lastly, you could have a Halloween party. This year, Halloween will be during the half term and it's an easy excuse to get your families or friends round for a party. Whether you are a fan of fancy dress or not, it is a brilliant way to spend time with those that you love the most and relax and unwind in the company of your nearest and dearest. So that sums up all of the lovely bits and pieces that you can get up to over the October half term. We hope you have a great break and we are looking forward to seeing you again very soon. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.